8675309 Jenny. Um, we're going to show you some of the chord changes. I'll show you that little lick in the beginning, and I'll have the tab there as well that might help you out a little bit more than just explaining it. Um, so basically, we're going to be dealing with the uh, the first, second, third string only for this lick in here. But we're going to put our first finger on the fifth fret of the second string, and then we're going to put our second finger on the sixth fret of the third string. Okay. So what we're going to do is we're going to start with the third string. Again, and then we're going to put our third finger on the seventh fret of the third string. Same direction. Three, two, one, and then back to lift up, and then slide down with your second, third finger. This uh, basically we're just going to be using the fourth fret of the third and second string. So here's what we got. And then it goes to an F sharp minor, and what you can do is do it as a bar chord. And what I do is I do the bar chord, just the first three strings, but my my position is still in a bar chord fashion. So F sharp minor D A. And also flat out, flatten out my first finger here to make the A. And I'm, I'm mostly concerned with the first few strings here that I'm playing. And to a B. So again, it's F sharp minor. D, A, B. So basically I'm down, up, down. That's pretty much for your verse parts right there. Um, then you've got that sort of build part where it hangs on the E. So here's both changes in here because it changes the second time. It goes E. right back into the chorus. There's one other major change in the song. It goes C sharp minor. I got it. E got it. F sharp minor. 